What's good, YouTube? Man, it's your boy, Jerron Fit, man, coming at y'all with a new video today. Man, I hope you guys like my last video, man. It was the, or excuse me, the Iron Addicts vs. Gym Gang Raw video, man. That shit was lit, man. Uh, so I hope y'all guys enjoy that. Well, I know y'all enjoy that, man, because y'all been watching the hell out of that video. And thank you guys very, very much for that. All right, today's video, man, is going to be about how to get your biceps to blow up using body weight. Uh, routines or body weight movements, primarily the, the chin ups. So I'm showing you guys different chin up variations uh, to use in conjunction with some weight training exercise to really blow those biceps up. Man, chin ups, not pull ups, are a real good way to blow up your biceps, man. They put a lot of stress, a lot of tension on the biceps, man. So it's a, a very underutilized movement. So here, you guys see, I'm actually doing close grip. Uh, chin ups and that puts a lot of tension on the biceps. Okay, and also I'm also trying to get my lower back to thicken up too So that's why I'm also using the, the close grip uh, chin up variation All right, and now I'm gonna go into the uh, a closer grip uh, Pull up overhand pull up. That's kind of this is really sick. Think of when you see this grip think of a hammer curl or a reverse grip bicep curl So that's kind of why I'm doing that movement and like you always see, man, I'm always having fun, man. I like to kick it in the gym, okay? So like I said, that's what I like to primarily do. So I'm showing you guys some good routines here to mix in. So first thing to do, if those biceps are lagging, would be chin-ups, okay? Then the next one would be the variation I showed you. Haha, <laughs> my dance moves. Can't mess with it. The, the other variation I showed you, close, grant, close hand, overhand uh, pull-up, okay? And so here I'm going to go ahead and do that again. I'm going to go a little closer with my hand placement, as you can see. And that puts a lot of fucking tension on my biceps, man. Uh, a lot of people do not use, they don't think of body weight movements as a way to build muscle. That's just completely not true. All right. And you see I'm pulling under control, stressing, squeezing that muscle. Okay. Then I go over here and I'm going to superset it with a cable uh, curl. I use the, uh, the preacher curl. The Cedar Preacher Curl to do that, to keep my movement nice and strict. And as you can see, man, look at that bicep contraction, man. The thing I, I tell people about uh, biceps, you really can't take too long in between sets. You really want to keep the pump in your biceps, uh, you you know, so you really don't want to take too much time in between sets. And as you can see, I'm using real good form here, really squeezing, you know, not using extremely heavy weight on the cables. Because like I said, I don't use the cables to build masses more so. To shape and develop the muscle, you know, and also for conditioning purposes as well. And as you can see, guys, man, the pump is, uh, is getting for real. It's getting serious. So now I'm not going to go through the whole routine because, like I said, it's been like a 30 minute video. But uh, what I would recommend if you're a beginner, start with the chin ups first. OK, and then if the chin ups are easy, then you go into the uh, these super sets I'm showing you and uh, how many sets you should do. Uh, I would say at least three rounds of it. So if you do uh, the chin ups, then superset it with the isolation curls I showed you. I would do at least three sets of that or three rounds of that, and uh, I would go high volume, at least ten reps on the chin up, and I would go for fifteen on the uh, curl. And now I'm going to switch over to uh, wide grip chin ups. OK, like I said, as you can guys, you can see my bicep is working. OK, I'm really focusing my mental portion of the rep, also my biceps. I'm really, really trying to get my biceps to do the brunt of the work, even though obviously the back is going to be doing something. OK, then I go over here and I use I like uh, try this. Man, I'm telling you, uh, using the preacher curl. On the with the with the uh, cable, with the wires, I get a really good uh, muscle contraction, a really good pump. Really good pump. It keeps my form strict. Uh, and that's what you're shooting for, honestly. Good strict form. You know, definitely want to go up and wait. And oh, yeah, yeah. A good thing to do, man, in between sets. I know people think you might be a douchebag or whatever. But pose in between sets, guys. That really does help bring out that muscle definition and help you get uh, more mind-muscle connection. So I hope you guys like this video, man. Please put any comments that you have below. And don't forget to check out my last video, Iron Addicts vs. Gym Gang. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. My shit, y'all. Peace out.